Hi, welcome to All Card Amster. Today we'll be taking a look at this car battery tester. Here's the brand name for it. The model is BT200. Some information printed on the back of the box over here. And let's take a look at a few pages from the user manual. As we saw from back of the box, this can test different types of batteries. ATM, gels, lead batteries even. In, out of the vehicle, charger test, crank test. So even for the crank test, it's pretty high. I live in Jersey, so where I live, we need a high CCA. Some more information here. Lately, I've been having problems with my, well, both of my batteries for both the Acura and the Honda. Things were driving less now. So if I leave the car on my driveway for about a week, two weeks without driving it, then I need to jumpstart it. First thing I did was I wipe off the tag so I can read it properly. Mine has a co-cranking amps of 700. It's only high because I live in Jersey. If I were living in someplace like Arizona or someplace that has more of a uh, warmer winter, it would not have such high co-cranking amps. Like this, red to red, black to bat black. Let's do a check. So I'm gonna yes, I'm gonna have it first do a check. It's currently in the vehicle. We do battery test first. Now so you take headlights on about 10 seconds, then turn lights off. All right. Okay. All right, did that. Let's do a regular CCA. It's supposed to be 700. That's a good recharged. All right, at first I thought I needed to change my battery, but according to this, it's in pretty good shape. Let's go to setup. Let's see what the setup is about. Language, beep, contrast, device test. Uh, screen test, I don't need that. The screen looks fine. I can review the last result if I wanted to. So this was the last result. Let's run the check in the vehicle. Let's do a uh, cranking test. Please turn off the engine before pressing enter to enter the test. All right, this engine's off. Now it says start the engine. says cranking normal. Good. That's a charging test now. Increase RPM to 2500 and keep that 10 seconds. Press enter to continue.
It says charging is normal as well. Good. Everything about this works out. I like this. It's tests a variety of things. Ch tests the charging capability. It tests the crank capability. It tests the battery health. I can test it when it's in the vehicle or out of the vehicle. And I can always go back and review my last test results too. Here's my Acura TSX. It's got a smaller size battery. And the CCA on this one is 500. Uh, let's do a check in vehicle battery test. Turn on the headlights. Regular flooded CCA of 500 this time. Hmm, this is in good shape too. All right, it's good to know. It's reassuring to learn that my battery's okay. Batteries these days are not cheap, so I don't need to make that trip to Costco or someplace to replace the battery now. And it's very easy to use, intuitive, straightforward, not much complication. And it tested my battery that was 700 CCA or 500 CCA, has a wide range. You can even test up to 1000 CCA if needed. So without any cons, I do like this item and I would recommend it. I'll place the link to this item below. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Walker Hamster. Bye.